Well, Australia Health's Toppenish Hospital hosted a groundbreaking event just a few hours ago. Our reporter John Franklin was at the ceremony and has the story. John. 13 million 109 thousand 67 dollars. 13 million 109 and 67 dollars. That's how much money was acquired for the Astria Toppenish Hospital's behavioral health unit expansion. We will expand from 15 beds to 29 beds and we will be able to re renovate our 15 bed unit that was built in the 1960s. It was a great effort but we were only able to put minimal uh, remodel um, and renovations into that unit so greatly needed. On Tuesday, the hospital hosted a groundbreaking event where Congressman Dan Newhouse spoke in front of a small crowd. This is a serious issue, mental health. Not just here, and, 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 but rural communities throughout the state and throughout the country. Um, so this is truly something that is needed. Well, she was not there, Senator Maria Cantwell sent one of her staff members to read a letter on her behalf. Thriving rural communities need health care delivery systems that don't require local patients to travel long distances or be stuck on wait lists. Increasing capacity at Astria Toppenish Hospital will, will enable more care for behavioral health patients and allow Astria to better serve our state's agricultural workers, members of the Yakima Nation, and lower Yakima Valley residents. A Yakima County Commissioner also spoke on how this is needed in the area. This is a great opportunity, not just for this hospital, but for the county in general. We have a great need for additional capacity birth for behavioral health, behavioral health care in this county. Reporting in Toppenish for Action News, I'm John Franklin. Thanks so much, John. And hospital staff say that the expansion will be able to help an, an additional 157 psychiatric patients annually.